Good evening, YouTube, and welcome back to the channel. Up here in the game room tonight, by my side, my main man Mando, as always. Hey, everybody. And General Grievous in the house. What's up, brother? Hey, Jack Raider. Okay, guys, I'm real excited tonight. So we're going to talk about that in a second. But first, I want to reach out and thank some people that's helped me out this week. So I got an Instagram account now. I'm going to have it in the description. You know, that's Jack Vader as well. So on Instagram, I met a lot of people who have been helping me out. So the, the Starlight Pit of Mask, thank you. Okay, he helped me acquire something I've been needing for a long time, and that's this right here. This is a Vader cape chain, okay? And uh, if you, it, it, it's very little and insignificant, you would think. But go ahead and try to find one of these, okay? It's almost impossible to find one. I had to ship one in from Germany. It was made of brittle plastic and it broke. And uh, I met this guy on, on Instagram, and he uh, helping me out with my suit and everything. So big, big Jack Vader salute to you, my friend. You'll okay. You're surprised how hard it is to find one. Tell of him, those. tell him, tell him, Mando. And uh, a couple of the guys, a couple of the guys I met on Instagram, the Dark Collector. He's doing big Sith things in Germany. Salute to you as well, Southern Vader, uh, Canadian Vader. Got Vaders all over the place. You guys are freaking outstanding. Been helping me out, and of course my main man, the Count Duku. Okay, with that said, fellas, why am I so excited tonight? Because tonight we have drop a sail barge named the Katana. Okay, so what we got here, guys, is a few weeks back I did a review that was loaned to me. Okay, and I fell in love with this piece. I've been searching for it ever since. Today I was able to procure one here in town, and uh, there it is, and here we are. So what we're gonna do, this is not a review. What we're gonna do is gonna break this bad boy out. We're gonna unbox it. We're gonna put it together. So it's gonna be a long review. Go ahead, feel free to uh, speed it up on, uh, on the parts because we're gonna do this on one shot, one take. Okay, guys, with that said, let's go ahead and crack into this thing. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and make the incision. This is case fresh. So uh, hopefully I'll open this up and there's not a bunch of rocks inside. We actually got a katana. Because that would be terrible. I would still post the video. <laughs> you guys know it's real if it has bubble wrap in it. You know it's real if it's got bubble wrap in it. All right. Ooh, I can't wait to see this. So you got to be real careful because you don't want to want to slice in. And I've seen people do that on videos. And I've seen, I've, I've done it. Mm -hmm. And uh, it's, it's, you know, you got to be real careful with that, with that blade. Especially so, with that. With a $2,000 thing. Well, hey man, it's easy, easy on the, easy on the it, it, ice prey. All right, so let's back it up. Back that side up right there, guys. What we're gonna have to do is we're gonna tilt this full, we're gonna tilt this on the side. So bring it up back. Okay, bend it forward. All right, just like that, okay? Now what we're gonna do is we're gonna back this up a little bit again. Okay, one more, one more, guys. All right, teamwork. Okay, and I'm glad we all we're all here together because this is like I said, this thing is massive. Oh all right, guys, let's keep it going, keep it going, nice and easy, nice and easy. Okay, so that's layer one. That was surprising. Let's get this out of the way. All right. Yeah. I can see the same. Okay. Now we have some kind of cardboard mailer. It is on mark. So, break out the tool again, and we're gonna. Make the incisions and move it along. You guys excited? I'm very excited. I am too, guys. I ain't gonna lie to you. I'm about eight years old right now. <laughs> so, Hokamay is about to run wild, brother. <laughs> All right. Oh, wow. Oh, oh wow. Here's okay. the box. Yeah, man, this is serious. All right. We'll keep it going. Go ahead. Open it up. Okay, guys. Second verse, same as the first. We're going to, uh, we're like to, oh, easy on that. We got yeah. some stuff over there. Let me, just, let me go ahead and okay. let me go ahead and take this out of the game of play. All right. Same thing, guys. Bring it back. Nice and easy. Tilt it forward. Nice and easy. All right, guys. Same thing. Slide this back. All right. One more. How to do it? All right. Get a rebus. Do the honors. All right. Oh, there it is. There's some paper. There's some paper in there. So there it is, guys. Let me get this out of the way. This is awesome. You tell them, guys. It's huge. Okay, so, all right, guys. Uh, everybody knows what this is. Let's go ahead and uh, talk about the packaging. 
This is uh, your standard vintage collection packaging. So on the back of the box, what they got is this uh, black and white imprint with the, with the red. Because um, if, if you were around back the first round, it, uh, when, this, when this stuff was on the shelf, it would look just like this. The cardboard, the cardboard wouldn't have been smooth like this. It would have been corrugated on the outside, you know, like a standard paper style. And it would have been, on the other side, it would have had the, uh, the smoother side with the, with the picture. So they're, they're, they're doing the similar style packaging, vintage collection. They got the Kenner on there. They got the Star Wars uh, vintage collection. And uh, I'm looking to see if they got a HasLab on there. Oh, they got the other side. Okay, so they don't have it on this side. Let's go ahead and uh, tilt it forward this way. Okay. Okay. Oh, wow. So it's reversed. So, let's go this way. Okay, Mando, grab that. Okay, keep it going, Mando. We're going to tilt it this way here. Okay, so on to the back here. Uh, man, this looks great. So you got all the little scenes, and uh, well, starting with the cockpit here. You got the uh, the part I call the the party room because the throne room will be back at his palace. So the party room, you got you got all the, everybody's present. You got the Fet, you got Bosk, to uh, high end uh, bounty hunters. Okay, you got the, uh, the the jail cell there. You got the the, the, the Gamora guard. You got my man here looking up, peering out the uh, out the uh, window. I forget his name. Uh, top decks, good, just good good action shots. Okay, this uh, put a lot of work into the box. So this box is definitely uh, collectible. It's definitely displayable. This is awesome. Okay. Let's see. Let's flip it again. And uh, let's look at the front of the box. Okay, so you got your uh, Return of the Jedi logo. Man, that looks great. And okay, so yeah, this this would look right at home back in 1983 on the shelf. Yeah, this would look fantastic. We have the picture of the toy, just you know, just just like they would back then. And you got the HasLab. We got the HasLab. Uh, it's like a 3D stamp on it. That's pretty cool. So, uh, and you got the Yak face and uh, the power of the Force coin. So uh, this this was a, uh, I believe three tier, and it hit all the tiers. You know, the Sarlacc pit. That looks great. So, uh, all right, guys. Uh, without further ado, let's get this thing open. Ooh, you so, don't have to cut it either. Don't have to cut it. Okay. So everybody get your little tabs. There's a lot of tabs, and this box is, I think it comes apart. You gotta come up with it first. Jeez. Yeah, it's kind of tough. You gotta use your palm. Right you gotta kind of, yeah. Use your palm. There you go. Yeah, so it's just kind of, kind of tough. But don't worry, guys. Just be easy with it, because this box alone needs to, uh, so it needs to stay, <laughs> stay in shape. Like the one big problem here is you have space. Here, put it this way. All right. So we're probably gonna have to put it down on its side in a second. So get the center one first. Okay, you got that, Linda? Okay. All right. I see the white picture. So I don't know. Did we get the right side up? Oh, uh, almost. So what we're gonna do flip it over. is uh, okay, we're gonna close it like this. Okay. And then uh. Start spinning it this way. We're gonna we're gonna set it to where when we open it up. And Amanda, go ahead and help me tilt that forward. Okay, let's get it straightened out here. Okay, so boom. And that's what that looks like on the inside, Ooh, guys. That's, that's a nice cup figure. Okay, so you got uh, that was one of the tiers, I believe. So go ahead and let's, let's start over here with the yak face figure. This is uh the vaunted uh, famous yak face that was, I believe it was released in Europe only. And then uh, they, they, they redid it for the, uh, the the Jabba Sail Bard. So that's included. Let's go ahead and get that bad boy out of there. Oh, it's carded too. Okay, uh, Mr. Grievous, uh, set that up next to that figure right there. Perfect, okay. And then we got some packaging here. Let's get that out. That's going to be the uh, instructions. So, does that go back? Yes, sir. Okay, so that's fine. That's like that. And then what we'll do is see the grievous come around to the side. Okay. Let's get this job out of here. That is a nice hollow figure. So, we're going to look at all this stuff in a second. Okay, and uh, let's see. Get this out of the leaf. Okay, that's going to be the sails. So, let's get this out of the way for now. All right, guys. So. This is what I need. This is the most okay. safe packaging in the world. 
Over there. I don't know. Well, I was just doubling. Oh. He fell off the side. He's fine. He's out okay. of the So, let me get this out of the way. Yeah, this thing's packed really good, so. Yeah. I'll get it, buddy. Okay. I'll get it. There you go. That is nice. Very nice. Okay. Now, what I'm going to do is get this up. Like, this going to be satisfying. Then we'll get the box out of the way. We'll fold it back later. I got it just, yeah, it just tabs together, so it's it's really cool because uh, it'd be easy to uh, put it back in the box if you need to. But it just tabs together really good, and we'll get this out of the way. Okay, guys. So first thing we're gonna do is uh, yeah, get the bars back. Is that heavy, Jack? It's uh, it's it's got some weight to it, but you know I can handle weight. Okay, guys, so go ahead and pull that out nice and easy. There we go. Oh, okay. Easy. No, 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 don't do that. Don't do that. Okay. Be very careful with that stuff. You got to pull for that. Okay. Okay, so let's get a good shot of this first. Okay, what do you guys think so far? I like, really like it. Looks really good. It's so clean. It kind of looks like a giant Air Force One sneaker. <laughs> <laughs> it does without the sails, does it not? Yeah. Okay, so we're going to get this stuff off. It's like a submarine to me. All right. Pull that off the side. I remember in our last review, mm -hmm. there also wasn't a panel right here. Okay, we got it, we got it this time. We just didn't have them in. So nice. Very nice. And we got this for a pretty good deal, too. We did. Okay. So, where's my other box I said over here? There it is. We're gonna open this bad boy up. And let's see what's inside here. It looks like a pizza box. It looks like a pizza box. <laughs> like <laughs> Alright. Ooh, this is nice. The sails. That looks nicer than this. This looks really cool, man. That does. So you gotta put all these sails together. Okay? And uh Hopefully the instructions are going to be kind to us. Wait, wait, we're going to have a fun time with this. <laughs> All right. I want to be careful with this. That thing's in there good. We don't want anything to snap. There it is. That's All right, that's that deck can in there. Ooh, that has a lot. You could just go by itself. There we go. Of a battleship. These are very nice. You're all right. Those sails look like scrolls. They do, don't they? All right, so we gotta get all this stuff out. First. And all this stuff out. All the little bits. Okay, so go ahead, man. We'll start working on those. Just be careful with them. Yeah, just keep them all together. These are easy to pop out. Well, it's going to be all in the instructions. We'll figure it out. Yeah. So uh, here we go. We got a couple more deck cannons. And then we got the boomerangs. And we got to get these out too. So go ahead and start working on those. These are all for the uh, the the sails. Yes, sir. I'm not going to get those out because okay. I don't want to break those. I got you. What you got to do the trick is you just pop them from behind. I know. Okay. I just don't trust myself with them. Okay. So. That's done. Let's get this out of the way for now. These are so nice. Thank you for holding it. it. Looks like pieces of a battleship, of a like old, like an old battleship. All right. It does. It do, it does borrow imagery from from like an old sail ship. But also it's got like futuristic aspects to it as well. That's why it's called a steam sail bar. Oh yeah, you're right, steampunk. So the, the, the art direction was really cool with this. I feel like every single like ship or droid of Star Wars looks always cool. Is that that one 3PO droid? 
Okay, okay guys. Okay. So that's going to be your sails. Ooh, they're rubber too. No, well, they're 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 plastic, but they're pliable because it, it needs to bend a little bit. Yeah, it'll, so give it that look. Yeah, and it'll pull tight over over the barge. So, and this is the other sail here. Really nice. And the calgric wood so will fit the aesthetic. There you go, buddy. There you go. All right, guys. So we're, we're clear there. Okay. The so let me get this out of the way. And uh, we'll start looking at the instructions. And uh, we'll figure this out, guys, because uh, I'll, I'll be honest with you. I don't know if you're this involved. <laughs> Skip back to your own risk. <laughs> yeah, so... Uh, let me uh, let me get these parts out of the way. Okay, it's so here's the other here's the other panel. It just fell off. This is where the foam begins. This is where the foam begins. Okay, so none of these panels are actually put in. Let's go ahead and put these bad boys in place first. You guys want to come around and put these other panels in? Sure. So you guys put this front one in. Okay. There. Stick it in there. You guys go ahead and do that. Now start with the top part. Put the top part in first. Like that. There you go, buddy. Oh, yeah, you got it. Just make sure it's flush in there. Yeah, that. It's not there. Good see. job. All right. Mando, you do this one. Let me see. It's going to go in that way. Mm -hmm. Get that, that wedge in there. Just gotta, there you go, up there. That's oh, it. there you go. There you go. So, okay, guys, go ahead and have a seat. Yeah. I'm gonna go ahead and try to do these. This is probably gonna be a little, a little too tough for you. All right, guys. So, right, let's get a look at this show. Java figure real quick. That looks really nice. Okay, so this is one of the tier figures. We'll just set them out so you can check them out. Yep. And he's got some. He's got some. A little bit of articulation. A little bit, okay. So let's get Jabba there. I think that won't make too much dirt. That's going to be the deck cannons there. So you can go ahead and go ahead and open that up for me, guys. Okay. We can go ahead and put those in now. And I'm going to break out the instruction booklet and see what we got to do with these sails. So read read before unpacking. I don't, can't believe I didn't I missed that. I was so excited that I skipped all that. Okay, so assembly required, no tools needed. Okay, so that's that's where we're at with that. Here's so, one gun out. Okay, you got one gun out. Here's another one. So let's go ahead and put a gun in now. Start the assembly process. Five. Okay. Tons of the big gun. Okay, so it's just warning you how to like unpack it. I mean, honestly, if, 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 if you bought one of these and you want to just rush and break out your box and dump it all out, you, you, you got what's coming to you. Do it because, at your own risk. You, you know what I mean? It's, it's very simple. It very, very simple uh, and not to do that. Okay, so it's saying first, let's start with... Uh, push this in. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Let's get the... Uh, where's the other cannon at? Right there. Okay, let's leave, leave it there for now. Because uh, what we got to do is put this bad boy on its side, okay? I need you to hold it, okay? Okay. Okay. And what these, what these oh, are? Oh, makes it float. Is yeah, it's, it's how we, it's how we're gonna get this bad boy to stand, okay? So you're getting a hold. Of what we're doing here? Um, these are like a tie heels. Cause it's I'm gonna, gonna, cause it's I'm gonna just extend it a little bit. Shot glasses. <laughs> yeah, the upside down shot glasses, little, little flasks. Yeah. Like little flasks. On the floor, it kind of looks like a slug. Yeah. All right. So, that ought to do it. Let's try to be careful when we put okay. this back up so it doesn't snap. So, let's, let's put it on its, on, its, on its new shoes. Boom. Ooh, that's nice. And we're off the ground. So, that we're off to a start there. So nice. We're off to a great start. All right. And uh, the, the, other, the other deck cannon, let's put it on the other side. Let's put it over here. I just really want to put a mirror under it now. Huh? I just really just want to put a mirror under it now to look like it's floating. Okay. That would be sick. Well, well maybe we'll do that when, when we uh, when, when we display it. This is for sure going to go on display. So we're going to get the main uh, the main artillery cannon, or what do you want to call this? 
Back here. Once we. Oh, that looks once great. Once we make some space, that that is a lot of detail on that cheese. That looks great, doesn't it? Uh huh. Okay. And now let's say in. Goes here. boys on so they go down and make sure not to mess anything up here okay so that one's on and we'll put the fin on the other side these are just the uh the fins that go onto the, onto the rear of the ship. Put this one on this side. That side's done. Nice. Okay. Now let's get on to the part that's going to scare us. <laughs> These sails. The part that's going to scare you. Uh, uh, oh yeah? <laughs> okay, so we're going to get one of these bad boys and we need to get some of these. Oh, that, just that little stick scares me. Okay, so it goes that way. I'm going to assemble those. And that's going to go that way. So the curve's going to go downwards. Yeah. Because the sail is going to go. Like that. It's going to go over it. So, okay. So once that's done, I'm going to attach the two small main braces, horizontal beams. So that's going to go in like this, guys. All right. Skip at your own risk. No, you don't want to skip this. Okay, so what we're doing is we're creating the frame. All right. It's like one of those model kits. It is, man. This thing is, I mean, it's detailed. Okay, so you see it's coming together. All right. So I believe that's one of them done now. It looks like a satellite. Okay. So... Let me uh, catch up the other one. It looks then, like pieces of a black pearl. It does. It, it's, it's got all it's got all those as, as, aesthetics. Okay, so again, we're gonna something like this one. We're gonna do the same thing with this one. All right. It's gonna be so satisfying when you put this all together. Yes, it is. It'd be cool to put some like. So you're looking for the male in and the female in right there. Easy guys. Sorry. Easy guys. I forget there's a glass right behind me. That's all right, brother. Not That's about. all right. Okay, guys. That is a nice yak face figure. We got we got one in the case, remember? Yeah, but we we had it on on display like, with the uh, with the with the review. Yeah, that was okay, like the one. So we got we got both those done now. Okay, so let me get this out of the way. We're almost there, fellas. We're almost there. Okay. These are the parts I need to put. We'll get that to that in a second. Let's just, let's just finish. Let's just finish these. Okay, so it's saying. Okay. These bad boys are connected to this somehow. Oh, I see. Okay, so we're gonna put that on in a second, but first what we're gonna do is we're gonna plug these in. And what these are gonna do is come down and actually connect this to the side of the uh, katana somehow. Right there, right there. Yeah, well, where, where the, um, did these come down? 
Yes, pop in right here. You pop in to the side. Okay, so so these are gonna pop in here, and then when I when I plug it in, it's gonna pop into the side there. Okay, so let's do that. You wanna make sure you do it the right side because these are not gonna. You wanna you want see where it's pl it's bent down at the end. You want that coming down this way so it plugs into the katana. So I'm gonna plug that in there. And make sure you don't break it. It's so satisfying just hearing all those clicks and snaps. Yeah, but you don't want to hear a click and snap that you don't want to hear, so you yes. want to be very careful with it. Especially make not sure, loud snap. Yeah, because these are very thin plastic, so. These other holes are where you can move the guns. Absolutely, and, all, and also, uh, I'm glad you said something, because there's figures that, that was, was made with the vintage collection that's got guns, and, and we got them still carded. Oh, yeah, you're right. You remember? Yeah. And, and I didn't know that. I found that out later, I'm a, and I'm going to bring those out and put those on, on here and, uh, when, when, when we do another video with this, so I'll, I'll update that. So. And, then, and it bottles, like, specifically for the barge. Okay, so okay, so these only, these have to go a specific way. These plugs are different. One's bigger and one's smaller. Okay, so this hole and this hole are not the same hole, so it can only go one way. So you don't have to worry about putting it on backwards, like just like I explained it, because it's not going to allow you. Okay, <laughs> they figured that out for you. Okay, guys, so th that's going to be the frame there. And I wonder if would be easier if I put that on first or if I did this first. I say see. put the thing on first because it's going to be all over. Okay, so here's how that works, guys. I'm going to stick that in one, one in. Maybe I should put this down. Okay, it goes in like that. Mm -hmm. Of those old slingshot pipes. Yeah. You're yeah. right. Okay, you got, you got one on this end too, so you're going to have to bend it a little bit to get it in. And then what it's going to do, it's going to create a very tight appearance okay like it's actually like a sail yeah, like, like a sail exactly then you want to bring this down and um, I got it backwards guys I got it backwards, but I knew was not a problem, not a problem. Okay, we just unplug that. Accidents, Accidents happen, guys. Accidents happen. Okay, so they are not one size fits all. Oh, oh this is terrible. All right, okay. that's very scary. <laughs> oh, I want you better not waste that. Oh, you want to do this one time, guys, I assure you. Okay, so all right, let's get that in there. because it's, it's just got a different shape on either side. So you want to put that in there, put that in there, put this in there. And the more these plug in, the tighter it gets. So this is gonna be a tight fit. Got it? And then the last one. Okay. Now let's just hope here. All right, guys, and that's gonna be the first sale. And that looks freaking outstanding. So uh, let's go ahead. And... Are they are they two different ones? Or are they both the same? Um, they're. I think they're both the same. I, I'm not too sure. Okay, so that's that. Plug that on your side, Amanda. Got it. Here we go, guys. Second verse, same as the first. It's fine, it's fine. I'll take care of it. That's fine. So, I'm pretty sure they're the same thing, so you might be able to skip this. 
No, we got, we got to do the same. We're going to do the same with you. Info every second. We're doing the full review. Okay, I just wanted to make sure I was on the right side, so I lined them up first this time. Good idea. Okay. Love for your mistakes, people. Oh, wait a minute. I forgot to put the anchors in. Never mind. got to put the anchors in first. So, uh, okay, same deal as the first. Plug that in. We're coming, we're coming up to the end, guys. This is going to work. Sweet when it's done, baby. All right. One more anchor. I feel like the one big question that, you're, that you guys are all asking, what are we gonna put this? <laughs> well, we're gonna we're gonna make room. We're actually gonna make room for this. This is gonna we're gonna revamp everything. Okay, guys. So I got the anchors in, and uh, now I need to make sure this lines up again. Okay, so that's going to be what I want. Correct. All right, so let's plug this side in. You know, I just know, Jack Peter. What's up, brother? As soon as we did that game room tour, we have like immediately changed the game room. It's changed every week, and, and I've been meaning to upgrade that and uh, do another video, so we'll, we'll find some time hopefully soon, and we'll update everybody on all the things that's happened here since then. Yeah, we have a lot of stuff on the we, we, we do. We made a lot of changes. We made a lot of changes. It'd be cool if y'all took some of y'all's, like, more smaller ships and hung them off the roof. Hang them up? Yeah, some fishing lines. Okay, we might try that. That would look cool. All right, guys, we're down to the last one, so these get tighter and tighter as you go. So I'm going to try to get this one. Is that the last step? This is the last one, man. This is the last. I think, like, this is, like, really the only major thing that you have to build. Okay, got it in. Okay, so there it is. Hey, guys. This is going to be sweet. I don't know, I gotta adjust this real quick, guys. Yes. Hold on, give me one. If you guys ever watched Avatar, it kind of looks like one of the ships from Avatar. Yeah. That's Airbender. Yeah. Okay. Okay, so let's do this. That's nice. Let's put this bad boy in. So that's where the baby's going. Okay. You see that? that? Mm -hmm. Okay. Get that side, guys. And then more to put those right. in. Let's go, ahead, let's go ahead and leave that alone, guys. All right, guys. It's last okay. thing. Last thing. Okay. So, yeah, I the chain like goes inside in the prison cell, but we need to put these bad boys up here in the front. You need to get those like, little baby hands okay, to do so that. You want a little bigger? <laughs> no, it takes too much room. Oh, it takes too much room. Well, some people actually want it a little bigger. They want to. They want it. They wish there was a, a third level. And I'm one of those people. But uh, as far as uh, what we ended up getting, uh, I'm pretty good with it. Okay, guys. So we're coming up to the end. We put this thing together. Uh, let me go ahead and take a seat next to you guys. I'll take up like three quarters of our show. All right, guys. So, uh, what are what are your thoughts? I really like this. Okay, you like it a lot. Uh huh. It's satisfying to build. Okay. What are your thoughts on this, brother? It looks like the Star Wars version of the Flying Dutchman. <laughs> <laughs> okay, guys. So, uh, again, guys, uh, I, I want to thank you for coming out and watching this tonight. Got the got the bars in the collection. So, who wants to take us out tonight? Let's go ahead and let's let's go ahead and you, you do it tonight, Mando. Let everybody know what's going on. Everybody, may the force be with you. <laughs>